And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, a nice evening is ahead for area football games, but a weak clipper will come through tonight with a couple showers like we had last night and early this morning. The thing about Saturday is any shower would tend to be before 9 a.m. Then it's going to turn out to be a really nice day. The rest of the weekend looks good. Monday looks very good. We could be 75 to 80. The record generally in the viewing area for most communities is about 80 to 82. So be close to that with strong winds Monday. And then another clip or Tuesday that'll usher in some slightly cooler weather. 50 tonight, Lafayette, 52 Fowler, 49 Burlington. So a mild night tomorrow. Nice warm day, 69 Winamax, 71 Monticello to 75 at Covington and 73 at Frankfort and Lafayette. But a very dry cold front will come through tomorrow evening. That'll usher in just slightly cooler weather for tomorrow night. So calm, crisp. Upper 30s northeast to low 40s elsewhere, 42 Lafayette. And for Sunday, still nice, 65 Rochester, 70 Lafayette, and 72 at Covington. High-risk future cast shows a few of these showers coming in overnight. This is 2.30 in the morning. A few showers then and around 4 o'clock in the morning. And then, boy, by 9 o'clock, we're getting them out of here. And after that point, even the clouds start to erode away. That's 1.30 in the afternoon. And notice how... We're mostly clear for the rest of the day. We're clear tomorrow night and keep it on the clock right through Sunday. Sunny skies, perfect day on Sunday with no clouds to even speak of. But then by Tuesday, a clipper will drop in out of Alberta, move into Kansas, then kind of round the bend and move northeastward. Now, not going to have a lot of moisture to work with, but I do think it could bring a few showers and thunderstorms to the area. Now, it's got a lot of strong wind fields in the atmosphere with it. It's a pretty dynamic system. If it were more unstable, more tropical in our area, we could even have a severe weather threat, but that does not look to be the case right now. 70 forecast shows the nice warm weather with the 70 on Sunday, the 52 Sunday night, 76 windy on Monday. The thing is, we get winds gusting to 40 miles an hour on Monday, kind of putting the kibosh on the fall color. And then 63, that's it for the low Monday night when the normal high is 57. A couple shower storms Tuesday, and then it cools off a little bit. Low 60s Wednesday, Thursday, 50s by Friday. And I think after that point, number one, we could have uh, a pretty hard freeze late next weekend. And then by around November the 5th, much warmer and perhaps a one to two inch rain with storms too. So. It's November. It's going to start to get active. Yeah, something tells me, though, that we're going to pay for all this warm weather at, <laughs> oh, in the fall. Isn't that what always happens yeah, here? We never is. get by easy. The yin and the yang. All right, yeah, thank you very much, sure. Chad. Hey, sectionals on the Friday Night Frenzy. That's right. Uh, we have season night 14 games tonight. Sectionals coming up. We'll take a look at which games the Frenzy crew will be.